welcome to my channel if you are new here hello you are spiritually connected with katiba that's for sure all right guys i'm about to take this solo trip out my kid asked if i'm like no <laughs> you know sometimes you just gotta take time for yourself uh, especially y'all you with big families and stuff i know you gotta fit in your family time and stuff but you gotta fit in your self love time as well your self guidance time your self um independent time okay so i'm about to go y'all see our scooter this is our baby she has been doing us so well okay so, all right guys first stop is the flower shop Guess we're about to buy themselves some flowers. Alright, let's see what they got. That's nice. We ain't doing all that today now. I actually want a sunflower. Which I don't know. Oh, there's some. Beautiful. Alright, y'all. This is what I came up with. And let me tell you why I love Mexico so much, okay? This whole thing right here just cost me $3, okay? Three US dollars. That makes my heart flutter, okay? All right, y'all, I was going to get some wings from my favorite wing spot, from vegan wings anyways, from my favorite spot ever, okay? I never thought I would have found it in Mexico. My favorite vegan wings ever, and they close. They close early now. So I didn't think about like, where would I put these flowers at? Because um, I actually just stuck them right here. But man, riding with these flowers ain't no joke. I should have got them at the end. But I want to have more with me for today. So I'm about to go to a different spot and go sit down, have some food, and probably some wine. Okay, so I'm at Don Chino. Chino? I don't know how you pronounce it. But when I say they got some good food, man, Ayana put me on. Shout out to you, Ayana. They got some really good pizza and some really good pasta. I'm here for the pasta today, y'all. I'm going to show y'all when it comes out. But man, when I tell you this food is on point, um particularly because it's not mexican okay i'm gonna be honest mexicans don't know how to make pizza that stuff be um they don't really use no sauce but this pizza man this pizza on point but i'm gonna show y'all my food because i'm out okay? one of my cheerleaders i love my cheerleaders man i don't know how they look at me but i feel like i'm like they cool auntie or that i'm that rich auntie okay <laughs> i love my cheerleaders man they be so happy to see me too when they see me in the streets. So cool. But all the people left the restaurant, so I'm the only one here. Now I'm gonna give y'all a little, little view. This is the inside. I'm in the indoor, outdoor. And these are my views. We live from Mexico. This pumpkin seed. Sauce is really good. Y'all probably like, what's she drinking on? Rose, okay? If you love me or like me even a little bit, buy me a bottle of rose, okay? The weight of my heart. Mm. Okay, here's the pasta. Okay, there's the sauce. I'm like, it's looking a little dry there for a minute. More pan. Self love is embracing yourself wholeheartedly, accepting your flaws, accepting the life that was given to you. Self love is loving yourself no matter who loves you, no matter who cares about you. It's a reflection of self-worth, of your inner knowing. Self-love is letting go of unhealthy relationships because you choose peace over pain. And with that, more love you will gain. Self-love is knowing that you are enough. Self-love is being able to fill your own cup. With self-love, you're able to pour into others. You're able to give like you are, even though you may not be a mother. Self-love is a reflection of your self-worth. The way you honor 
the way you value yourself, even though sometimes it hurts. Do you love yourself? Do you know your worth? Got a bottle of wine to go. I'm taking it home to my baby. So I passed on the ice cream, but I got a brownie and ice cream on the house. Because that's just what happens when you're abundant in life. I promise you. That's what happens when you give abundant. My flowers. Flowers. Baby said, who bought you some flowers? I thought I, I bought them for myself. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm back home. Baby be missing me. Boy, when I go out on my own, she be missing the mess out of me, okay? I appreciate that. I love that. Um, I feel so full right now. I'll be honest. You ever feel so good that you could just cry? Like, I feel so good. I feel so full. I feel so abundant. I just feel great, y'all. So I'm going to continue to enjoy the rest of my day. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for coming along on my solo, dolo journey with me. Um, that's the hack, y'all. That's the hack to self-love. I'm not going to even lie to you. If you've never done nothing special for yourself, I highly suggest that you go and do something special for yourself. Yes, we all expect others to do something special for us. We do something special for others quite often. But when is the last time that you've done something special to yourself? So that's all I got for this video, y'all. Stay spiritually you. Stay spiritually in tune. Let me know what you've done for yourself lately in the comments or what you plan to do. And I'll see y'all next time.